Staying with Adamawa State, the Speaker of the House of Assembly, Aminu Iya Abbas, has donated five ambulances to five wards in Ubagaya community in the Hong local government area of the state. The community's cottage hospital was attacked by a Boko Haram sect in 2015, where the outlaws carted away medical facilities. Details in this report. The socio-economic livelihood of agrarian community of Obagaya in Hong Loki government was affected by activities of the dreaded Boko Haram during their sway in seven Loki government areas of the state. The Speaker of Adamawa State House of Assembly has also reached out to thousands of victims of Boko Haram in Hong Loki government, his immediate community with ambulances. I promise my people that when I win election, I will give them ambulances in five clinics. And today we are going to witness those ambulances delivered in those five clinics. These are some of the promises we made. And we are going to deliver after the order. He also gave 23 vehicles to religious institutions and the PDP ward chairman, explaining that the initiative is in line with Governor Amado Fintry's promises during campaigns. Now, all the places they ask for things, whether water or classroom, we gave them all. And I promise during my campaign that when I eventually win election, women will no longer pay for money and today we keep that promise. The beneficiaries and the state PDP chairman thanked the speaker and urged other well-meaning Nigerians to emulate him. I'm very happy about what our honorable speaker has done to our world because this is first in our history. Meanwhile, a philanthropist, Dr. Emmanuel Musa, has also reached out to the vulnerable and Boko Haram victims with assorted drugs at Obagaya. Uh, for the speaker, I will say kudos for the service delivery, kudos for the petition for the education, kudos for the development of democracy, not only to the people of Korea, but to humanity generally. The ancient Obagaya town in Hong Loki government was the worst hit community with government buildings destroyed when Boko Haram insurgents were in control in Adamawa in 2015. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.